Hello, and welcome to the Daily Orthodox Christian Script Reading for the 10th week after Pentecost, Tuesday. The first reading of the day is from St. Paul's first letter to the Corinthians, chapter 15, verses 29 through 38. Brethren, what do people mean by being baptized on behalf of the dead? If the dead are not raised at all, why are people baptized on their behalf? Why am I in peril every hour? I protest, brethren, by my pride in you, which I have in Christ Jesus our Lord, I die every day. What do I gain if, humanly speaking, I fought with beasts at Ephesus? If the dead are not raised, let us eat and drink, for tomorrow we die. Do not be deceived. Bad company ruins good morals. Come to your right mind and sin no more. For some have no knowledge of God. I say this to your shame. But some one will ask, How are the dead raised? With what kind of body do they come? You foolish man, what you sow does not come to life unless it dies. And what you sow is not the body which is to be, but a bare kernel, perhaps of wheat or some other grain. But God gives it a body as he has chosen and to each kind of seed its own body. And today's Gospel reading is from Matthew chapter 21, verses 23 through 27. At that time, when Jesus entered the temple, the chief priests and the elders of the people came up to him as he was teaching and said, By what authority are you doing these things, and who gave you this authority? Jesus answered them, I also will ask you a question. And if you tell me the answer, then I also will tell you by what authority I do these things. The baptism of John, whence was it? From heaven or from me? And they argued with one another. If we say from heaven, he will say to us, Why then did you not believe him? But if we say from men, we are afraid of the multitude, for all hold that John was a prophet. So they answered Jesus, We do not know. And he said to them, Neither will I tell you by what authority I do these things. Thank you for listening. Let the brightness of the Lord our God be upon us and direct the works of our hands to do good. See you tomorrow.